I think it's a pussy decision, basically, for the RIAA to, to, to make this label and like to try to appease these people. Um, I think it's a weak decision, and I, I think that they have no backbone, and they should have stood behind free speech and said, fuck you, we're not going to stick a record. People have the freedom to say what they want to say. The controversy just sells records, and please, like please color. make our album like seem as, like, as forbidden as possible, because the forbidden fruit always tastes sweeter. Just for instance, our show in Memphis, I think of all the southern cities, this is, the Memphis show is the only one that sold out in advance, and that's the only show where they've passed a local law that said that you can't sell tickets to an 18-year-old or under. So th there it is in action. That was one of my biggest fears. It is my biggest fear that our show is going to get X-rated. You know, A kid should be able to sit down with his parents and listen to an album and say, explain this to me. And a parent should be responsible enough to be able to explain this to his, his kid, not just take it and say, oh, you can't listen to these kind of records, this is devil music, you know, without even giving it a chance.